Justice Obiera, Iguatu of the Federal High Court in Abuja has declared the arrest and unlawful detention of the human rights activist Omoyele Shore on August 3, 2019 by the lawless operatives of the Department of State Services, DSS, as illegal. The court also ordered the DSS to pay the sum of 1 million naira and aggravated damages to the activist. 1 million naira. What is 1 million naira? After how many years? So does it mean now that they are going to allow him leave Abuja or what? The judge gave the order on Monday while ruling on the fundamental right suit filed by the activist to challenge his unlawful abduction at a Lagos hotel for asking Nigerians to take to the streets and protest against bad governance, insecurity and corruption. The activist had on November 15, 2019 filed a suit marked FHC-ABJ-CS-1407-2019 challenging the director General of the Department of State Services DSS Yusuf Bichi and Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice Abubakar Malami for his illegal arrest and detention. The activist, through his lawyer Abubakar Marshall, <laughs> asked the court to declare his unlawful detention by the DSS as illegal and a gross violation of, of his fundamental human right to liberty. He also asked the court for an order compelling the DSS to pay to him the sum of 500,000 naira, 500 million naira as general and aggravated damages for the illegal violation of the applicant's fundamental right to life, the dignity of his person, fair hearing, health, freedom of movement, and freedom of association. Justice Obiora Iguta, Iguatu. Of the Federal High Court in Abuja has declared the arrest and unlawful detention of the human rights activist Omoyeli Shiwore on August 3, 2019 by the lawless operatives of the Department of State Services. The court also ordered the DSS to pay the sum of 1 million naira and aggravated damages of the activists to the activists. The judge gave the order on Monday while ruling on the fundamental rights suit filed by the activists to challenge his unlawful abduction at a Lagos hotel for asking Nigerians to take to the streets and protest against bad governance, insecurity and corruption. Hmm. Okay. The activist through his lawyer Abubakar Masha asked the court to declare his unlawful detention by the DSS as illegal and a gross violation of his, of his fundamental right to liberty. He also asked the court to, for an order compelling the DSS to pay him a sum of 500 million naira and uh, as general and aggravated damages for the illegal violation of the applicant fundamental human rights well i think uh, he has been able to win the case again when they were talking about it uh, oh he was calling for uh, uh, what's it called Res uh, revolution and do you know that the Buhari government just twisted it? That when you talk about revolution, this is it, this is it. And everybody knows literally what he meant by that. But at the end of the day, the court still ruled that he didn't violate any, 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 whatever, any law. That that revolution is a normal thing. Because Buhari, the same thing, the same Buhari, everything he does, if other people do it, it will amount to something else. But if he does it, nothing is, no, it's, it's a normal thing. Well, one thing about a uh, one good thing about him that that guy is stubborn. He's stubborn. You can't with all of these things. Any little thing is always out, and he's irritating some people the way he, the way and manner at which at which he carries himself, and he's so confident. He irritates a lot of people, and I don't know, like I said, whether they are going to allow him to leave Abuja now, because one thing is for him to be allowed to go and one thing is for them to pay the money because we know that they will not even pay the money but let them allow him to move around because it's illegal maybe they are going to challenge that only god knows how many people buari owed money now anyway congratulations to mr shiwari even though he won against lawless organization who will not respect the verdict lawless eye service activist akba amo bingo like you can you imagine some people are not still happy you can't do anything the country is is, is destroyed you are there suffering somebody who is coming at who is bold you are so coward and yes you are still abusing him hmm. we know your type of course we know you we know his type this one enter your you enter them well 
he entered them well because he's, he's, he's angry that say, the man is released. Once you hear Akwa uh, Bingo, we already know that it is a Janjaweed talking. Forget the name. Now, full anima, now they talk this kind of thing. The normal woman being will not say this. It is those who are from that side that, that they love all this impunity, violence, and all of that. It is only in Buhari government criminals are winning in court. Hey, I'm surprised the way kidnappers, cattle rustlers, Ibob, and Boko Haram terrorists are giving amnesty and this set of criminals are winning in court. That is the question for your Oga Buhari. You see that all these Northerners are not happy. They are not happy. Nigeria DSS has never won any case against them. Meanwhile, or meaning they are doing the wrong thing. Of course, I don't know how many of you have listened to the CGN. Tanko, he said all the allegations against people that the federal government has brought, that they cannot defend them. So what else do you want to give? What else do you want to hear? Is Buhari still in charge? Too many court cases go against him because the CGN has made the his stance known. He has cleared the retreat, the retruth. That means Abakari is also innocent. Now today, which damage Nigeria has no action in such activity? They can only see it, but the question is who will enforce the judgment? Hmm, okay. So award is not the problem, but implementation. Ask Igbo Namdekano how markets. This is for those who have lost their rights and yes, claim they are citizens. Hope they have brain now to stand firm for their rights, no matter how foolish majority feel about it. That is it. Majority, they, they are on the other side because their own case is that, is that if I cannot beat them, I will join them. More grace to Shuwore. Congratulations to the incoming president, Federal Republic of Nigeria. So, Buari Teno, don't they finish? Unasabi how to do the right thing. Lawless country. Congratulations, Mr. Shore. They will soon file another <laughs> paper with additional or amended charges. Shameless DSS. Congratulations, Mr. Shore. Victory to our new president. These people from the other side are in severe pain. Of course, they are in severe pain. In severe pain. They are not happy. Omaya Shore, Victoria Astata. DSS is nothing but fools. They are fools. They are foolish. Like somebody said, before you know that, they will say they will appeal it just to keep people. I don't know. And, oh God. Hmm. What they want this country to look like, they, what they want Nigerian people to look like, just that like anything, just, don't just say anything, just continue living your life. Living your life, be praying to God. Mm -hmm. Then the politicians will be doing their own thing. That is just all they want. So guys, let's say your opinion concerning these judgments.